We just got to the trailhead of Lupine Meadows and now we're gonna sleep for three and a half hours. <laughs> uh, no, no, four and a half hours. Yeah. So that's enough for one REM cycle. We're going to have to take out Aaron's seat, jam everything up here, and then sleep in the back on top of old french fries and chips. Night night. All right, well, it's time to go to bed, and unfortunately, or fortunately for Aaron, he's decided to sleep outside in the grass. So that means more room for Chase and I, and a uh, possible grisly death, literally, for Aaron. Chase doesn't know this, but his alarm's about to go off. Sorry, buddy. Aaron's sleeping on a cold slab of earth outside in front of the car. Today we're gonna climb or hike or run something called the Cloud Bell. We don't know how many miles it is and we're getting a late start, so that's the perfect combo for a rescue helicopter later in the day. <laughs> We're getting out there, we're getting at it early. Probably like seven o'clock. So the route is called the Cloud Bell Traverse, is that right? right? The Cloud Bell Traverse. Traverse. Gonna head up Garnett <laughs> Canyon to the lower saddle and then bust the left and then go over a bunch of little craggy mountains, uh, many of which are called Tetons and others are called Cloud Bell and Snow Cone and Glyke or something, snow, right? Something else. Ice cream cone. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> ice cream cone, not snow cone. Not to be confused with snow cone. Uh, the boys are just trying to figure out where we are and where we're going. So I wonder if that's Cloudville there. Yeah. Yeah, that's a dome. Unless that's Cloudville and that's Nez. We're just trying to figure out where we're going today. We're gonna to be doing something behind us. That much we know that we're gonna be doing this area here around the crown of my all, head. All of what we see, we will do. We don't know what it is. All right, we're headed up the Middle Teton after voting against attacking on the Grand. Top of the middle Teton, there's Danny and the marker. In some ways I could see how this might make the most boring movie of all time. Up, down, up, down. Kind of everything looks the same. We got to the top of Ice Cream Cone. We actually backtracked to Summit Ice Cream Cone. These guys are dedicated ridge walkers. They were like, it won't be an honest um, Cloud Veil Ridge Traverse if we don't go back and hit Ice Cream Cone. Obviously. As you can see behind me, we still have way, we have a lot of ridge to go. So we have this bad boy, and then Cloud Veil, and then Nest Pierce. last little section was it's a major drop-off really cool we're on the namesake peak 
Cloudvale Dome, as I've been reminded constantly by Chase. The last section was some steep, awesome scrambling. Whoa! Yeah. This is some serious exposure. You gotta love when you stand up on a ridge and that happens. Yeah. One more peak to go. We just wrapped up the Cloudvale Traverse. Although though we're not done yet, I suppose. We, got to, we still have to get down. I was actually feeling a little lightheaded on the way up. And hopefully nothing a Milky Way won't fix. We're uh, on the top of Nez Pierce or whatever the hell it's called. We don't really know. We've been pushing peaks all day, so we're pretty tired. Cool, you can see the whole route behind me. It was worth it. It took us forever. Let's see the time. Yeah, <laughs> so no. <laughs> No record breaking today. Now the challenge is to get down as quickly as possible. I don't really want to run through bear country in the dark. And I just don't want to get attacked by a bear and have pictures of my bloated naked corpse on the internet. Wrapped up the uh, all the trick, the technical parts, the tricky parts. We're about ready to hop on a trail. Head on out. Today we started at Lupine Meadows in Grand Teton National Park. Ran up to the Lower Saddle, went up to Middle Teton, South Teton, Ice Cream Cone. Geike Tower, Spalding Tower or Peak, Cloudville Dome, and then Ne Per Se, Nez Pierce. Pronunciation is to be determined. We made it back to the van, hashtag yeah. van life. So we have we have a difference of opinion between all our devices. What was your mileage? 25.9. Mine was 26.3 and my watch was 18.7. So you win, man. And my brain? You the marathon. I'm going 21 with about 9,000 feet of climbing. It's fantastic. Every step. It was amazing. Yeah, it was amazing. Yeah, yeah. What a day in the maybe, maybe one of the best traverses we've ever done. A great Just day saying something yeah. for, for a group like us. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was one of the coolest traverses I've ever done. You say